Soccer 605, I'm here with senior goalkeeper Felicia, Felicia Ryman, uh, senior at Morningside, Stevens alum, um, just finishing up your senior year. Yep. You know, you've had a tremendous career um, with Morningside in the goal. Uh, I think I was reading, your, are you the all-time saves leader? Um, I think I'm third on the list right now at Morningside and 30th in the nation for um, goals against uh, in an average game or something. That's pretty good, especially having, uh, you know, you missed some time with an injury to your hand. And, uh, you know, um, so now you're behind this team. Looks like, uh, you know, you're on, on a march to finish out your year pretty well. Yeah, we are. We've had our um, first couple of games were real tough. We played Hastings our first game. We knew that was going to be tough. Um, we've had some other harder teams, and now we're kind of getting to the middle of our season where we just want to continue, not let up. So, you know, as you as you stepped into this college career, you know, you'd had a lot of good training at Rushmore. And uh, do you think that, uh, you know, that has made all this possible for you? I definitely think it was the training I got when I was younger. I started playing in the goal when I was 12 because I played softball and it was just a natural fit. I loved it in the goal and that's what I've always been told and learned that you have to love it to play there. And I just started training. Um, first, I did like the, they do a college coaches week. I started there. I've worked with Brandon Vargas in the goal. I've worked with Josh Miller in the goal. Um, I've also gone to my own camps and done a lot on my own. So, But I would definitely say Rushmore is an excellent foundation for me. So, you know, you've, you've got a lot of South Dakota players uh, in your team. Do you girls uh, kind of make that distinction there, or is everybody just part of the family? Um, we all are definitely just a big Mustang family, but we do make our jokes about South Dakota being the best or that great faces, great places, that's us. And we just we make our jokes. But, yeah, it is known that the South Dakota girls come to play. I mean, we start five Rushmore alums, uh, three from Stevens and two from Central. So it's definitely a big deal that we see that Rapid City comes and represents. And we, I mean, they're freshmen and they're starting. We have, me and Carly have already started, Rachel's already started. So we come in as freshmen and start because we've just been that prepared by Rushmore and by our high school programs. You know, Coach Maxson has that uh, connection to Rushmore. Yeah. And, uh, man, he comes back and uh, year after year after year gets you gets you girls that uh, grew up in Rushmore, and it's really doing his team a lot of good. Oh, yeah. He likes the way we're coached, and he you can use it to his best advantage. And he they coach similar, so it's a good fit for us as well. as It works good for him, and it works good for us as players to play with somebody that coaches similarly. I know, uh, you know, that's always kind of a bittersweet deal when you're winding down your senior year and your career at college, but uh, any plans afterwards? Um, right now, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm actually graduating in December, so I should probably figure it out here quick. But I've got some, um, I'm thinking about going to USD and finishing a degree up there when I can't finish at Morningside. Um, I've worked with goalies back in Rapid, Nikki, who plays for Central or Stevens right now, um, and a couple others. My sister is currently training as a goalie and some of her teammates. So I've worked with goalies over the summer. Um, KP is there, and I've worked with him coaching goalies. I coach the Stevens goalies um, during preseason. Or, yeah, their little tryout deal. So I've d definitely I like working with them, and I'll probably continue doing that. Well, fantastic! I'm I'm so glad to see that, and you know you got a lot going for you, and you have a lot to pass on to some of these kids. Uh, I'm sure you got a lot of cred with them too. So we hope to see you uh, out here someday on the sideline, telling a bunch of kids what to do. Yeah, I hope so too. Thanks. Thank you.